was the most successful fundraising appeal ever, and so I'd better quantify that. By 1946, the appeal had raised over £54 million. Pounds. That is the equivalent of £7.7 .7 billion pounds today, making it the largest char charitable fund ever raised in the UK. As I said at the beginning, past fundraising ideas have shaped the fundraising we do today. In 1939, thousands of people were inspired to make small donations, which collectively helped those affected by the war. Right now, thousands of people are making small donations, which collectively are helping those affected by the conflict in Gaza. Both appeals allow the public to express their solidarity with people whose lives have been torn apart by war. The DEC's Gaza appeal may be in different times, but the principles of fundraising remain the same. So aside from all the money, why was this fundraising initiative so exceptional that it made me want to stand up here today and say, I wish I'd thought of that? Well, during a time of emotional and financial strain, and with the feelings of uncertainty about the future that the war brought, it hardly seems like an ideal time to launch an innovative and pioneering fundraising appeal. However, the need was there, so the Red Cross and St John were not deterred. Their efforts led to what was described as the greatest act of collective generosity and changed the face of fundraising forever. So I think we can all take something from this. Be bold, be brave, and think big, because you might just achieve something exceptional. Thank you.